In our tiny little state with our low population, at any one day, any given day, 2,500 kids are in foster care. CASA comes into the picture when a child has been abused and neglected by their parents, and the state steps in and removes the child from the home. The child is assigned an attorney called a guardian ad litem. Mom has an attorney, dad has an attorney, there's a social worker involved in the case, there's an attorney for the social worker, and all these people are involved in this child's life until the judge has decided whether or not the child can go home safely. The CASA is the one that has the overview of the whole picture of what's going on in that child's life, and that's what the judge looks for. She depends on the CASA to really bring the heart and the big picture back into the story. When a child turns 18, if they're not going to go home to mom and dad and there's nobody going to adopt them or, or be a guardian for them, they age out of the system. These kids, within two years, statistically, 50% of them will be pregnant, will be, have drug problems, will be homeless, or will be dead. And so we started the Power Up Youth Transitioning Program. Yeah, we really see Power Up as, as making sure that that child has one caring, consistent adult in their lives. If you can have an impact on one or two children's lives, that's big, that's huge.